Oh man, and now here we go. World Heavyweight Title Match. Fun. Tongo facing your WHC World Heavyweight Champion Alberto Del Rio. Fondango has done so much and he's just he's debuted a new attire and he's just he's not the same person. But now Alberto El Patron could could he win the fight? And could he retain his title? That is a big, big question. And now from Mexico Alberto El Patron Still got that WWE Championship. Oh boy. But anyways, your world heavyweight champion Alberto You know what you just heard me do it, you're probably annoyed by it already, so yeah. But now Mr. El Patron has got a lot on the line. But so does Fondango. This is a chance between winning and losing. You just gotta wonder who wants it more. And by more, who is willing to fight? To fight and win that title. Whoa, what happened? I am very sorry about that. I had no idea what just happened. Oh. Look at, oh, what a super kick taking his head off. And now. Gotta fight back. It's Fandango. Oh, but Del Rio throws him off. Ah, oh, and but Fandango was still right on Del Rio. Throwing punches. Del Rio reverses. Oh, but eats a knee. Oh, and now Fandango throwing straight up punches. Right in the other corner. And a chop, but Del Rio reversing it. But Fandango reverses it. Oh, look out. What could we see? Oh, floats over. Sunset flip power bomb. Didn't pin. Oh, and a leg drop. And now he's just showing off, getting a little dancing done. Right in front of Del Rio. Del Rio, or not Del Rio, El Patron doesn't look too uh, happy about that. I've got him wrote on my roster as El Patron. I just don't know why I keep saying Del Rio. But now, after Survivor Series, wow, what a drop kick. There is going to be a um, draft, a WWE draft, so I hope you guys are excited for that. But yeah, the universe mode I think has turned out really well, especially since I can like um, do cuts and edits and stuff. Oh, and a clothesline. But I mean, yeah, I, I really enjoyed making this, and this is something I always look forward to do. Because universe mode is like very exciting for me. Open. Oh, kick to or a punch to the stomach and a chop. Oh, now look out, El Patron. I got it that time. Oh, rebounds off the rope is Fondango. And a power slam. And oh. Oh, but look out. Reversal right there from Fondango. And oh, right to that leg. Oh, he can't. He can't either get as much torque as he could if he was going for the arm bar. Because you gotta have torque on that uh, leg of yours to uh, actually get it. Now look at. Oh, look at that. Oh. The fact that he just lifts him up by his legs, or well, how he lifts his thighs, and then just drops him was awesome. And, oh! Standing cutter! We could have a new champion! Oh, look out! He's going up! He's so happy! Oh, man, look at him. Just so happy about this. But, oh, no. Nah. Fondango, I think, waited a little bit too long for that. Oh, but now look out. Wait. Oh, ravishing neck breaker. Now what's he doing? Oh, elbows from Del or El Patron. Oh, reversal. Oh. And now look out, look out. Spiked him with that DDT. 
and now picks him up. Oh, and then arm drag into that corner. And now a chop in the corner. Oh, now look out. The, or El Patron, oh, belly to belly. Oh, and a huge, um, what's that called? I guess a crossbody, a springboard crossbody. And now, turns him around. Oh, now what's he doing? Punches him from behind. Wait, what is he? Oh! Oh my goodness! Turn him inside out! Oh, now he gets up. Now wait a second! A small blaze of glory right there! Oh! He's gotta go up and do it! He has got to! No! He didn't get enough time! That small blaze of glory could have just helped him a little bit more. Oh! And now picks him up. Oh, now bridging, or not a bridge, but a Northern Lights suplex without a bridge. Oh, and a reversal right there from Del Rio. Oh. Reversal again. Now what has Fondango been trying to do? Oh, brings him down. Good night. Oh, super kick. Wow, got him planted. Oh, he's going up. We're about to get a taste. Well, not a taste. But a blaze of glory. Come on, Del or El Patron. Oh. Now look out. Face Buster. Oh my goodness. Oh, now he's showing off a little bit. I don't think the crowd's a, a big fan of Fondango yet. But now look out. You're about to get a taste of goodness. And now going up. Oh, and now blaze of glory. Oh my goodness. Wow. And now he's he's going up for another one. Or I think that's what he's doing, but he's going up. Oh, and he gets it. Just to be sure. One, two, three. What? What? How does someone kick out of that? Oh, and Fondango. Oh, I think he was going to roll him up or something. Oh, reversal. Oh, no, look out. German suplex. How does someone kick out? Oh my goodness, Del or El Patron has got so much fight. Now what's he doing? Oh, brings him that, or brings him at the ropes. Now what? Oh, and a drop kick. Took his head off. Oh man, the crowd chanting C, but he's about to see you later. Oh my goodness! Oh, brought him down. Count it, ref. One, two, three. Wow. And your new World Heavyweight Champion, Mr. Thon Dongo. Who knows? Maybe he can. He always says it better than me. But now. The new World Heavyweight Champion. Now this is a sight to see. You just had to give him one chance, just like Roman Reigns. And now we've seen... He is your champion. 
And now, wait. So something doesn't seem right. I don't have a good... No. I think, wait, what? I'm, I'm just received news. From, are, you, are you sure? Okay, okay. Seth Rollins has put in his rematch clause. Oh my goodness. Why? Well, you know what? It's kind of like your rematch clause on in this universe is like your money in the bank. You get it. You deserve it. He beat Fandango. And I guess in a way, you know, he, he must have talked to the boss really well. You know, sweet talked him. Because now he's got his match. Got what he wanted. <coughs> Excuse me. But yes. Seth Rollins, dead staring at Fandango. This is unbelievable. Look at it. Oh my goodness, it really is for the world title. Fandango just had that. <clears throat> he hasn't even had it for a minute. Whoa. <clears throat> had no idea what just happened there. But now Fandango. That had to be funny for you guys. I'm not even lying. Ah, uh, now Seth Rollins. Oh, what was that? And now Rollins. Oh my goodness. And now a punch right there. Oh, and they start brawling. Oh, oh, and I need to that stomach. Oh, and now these kicks. Oh, and eats another kick. Oh my goodness. Why, Seth Rollins is almost a genius. Oh. I mean, who would have expected this? I know Fandango wasn't. I mean, he's fine like he's ready. But, I mean, mentally, he doesn't seem ready. Oh, look out. Fights back. Oh, gut buster right there. That's very smart. And now back in the ring. Oh, look out. Suplex. Goes out of that ring again. Oh, brought down. No, wait a second. Rollins has got him down. And now he's dragging him into position. Look out. No way. Curb stomp. No. One, two, three. No way. New World Heavyweight Champion. Oh, my goodness. No freaking way. This right here is where he curb stomped him. Look out the angle. Oh, that was so effective. And then Rollins pinned him and got the one, two, three. This, this Survivor Series. But like I was thinking, or, well, I was sort of saying, if you have a World Heavyweight Championship re or clause, at least rematch clause, you know, you're untouchable. Unless you, like, well, at least if you're gunning for a title, I mean, it's almost like money in the bank. Fondango won a title, and Fondango lost a title. Just like The Miz. He had the title, and he lost it to Roman Reigns. Well, guys, let's go to part three.